did you know that Pampers Premium has sort of like re-imaged or remodeled or pretty much that they are Pampers Premium nappies I bought them the other day and uh, at the expo as well it's part of the haul that I'm gonna be showing you guys just now and I just opened the package and oh my gosh they look so adorable so this is what they look like right now they look so stinking cute look at the design in the back but that's not just it they've also upgraded their absorbency which has been amazing peanut has been going through the worst when it comes to teething he's got a runny tummy he's running fevers like right now he's so clingy because his bum is raw because of all the runny tummies and the delay in changing his nappy sometimes i hate school for that so i honestly decided to go ahead and buy pampers premium and switch him over and see how that goes especially since i found out that they have done a little work on their nappies and they have been incredible they are so light so breathable and they look so stinking adorable i don't know if you guys remember but i made that video comparing pampers and huggies and i said they weren't very like on the sides they didn't have that flappy thing to catch all the runny mess in case the nappy leaks let me tell you guys something right now they have fixed that stretchiness situation and uh, the nappies fit so well and so comfy around his little thighs that they do not even leak anymore they have also worked on their stretchy situation on the side so when you close the nappy it is nice and stretchy so that you can make it go around baby's waist so that you don't have to have that leak on the side because you know sometimes when kids sleep on their side and they have a runny poop or they pee it can go on this side <laughs> it can escape right there they also feel so much soft and so much silkier than they were before and they feel so much more smoother and silkier especially inside i don't know if you guys have used pampers premium before but they used to have this little thing where you touch inside and you're just like why are they so rough but right now they have the little quilt and the hot situation but they are so so I wanted to quickly tell you guys that because I honestly find it super incredible. Not just the design because that is also adorable. You guys know I'm a sucker for everything that's cute. But also because they are so much better than they were before. And um, this is money well spent. I'm not going to lie to you guys. They are amazing. They look so stinking cute. So that's that. Let's get on with the vlog. What's up guys? I'm so late for a meeting. I should have been here at 1 p.m. It is 1.23. Thank you traffic. I'm at the baby expo because I do have to get a couple of things but before then we have like a meetup that started at 1. I wonder if they've started already. And after that I need to get nappies but most importantly I need to get peanut a car seat. Home guy needs a car seat. By the way I've never been so free when traveling. Like, I have no kid with me, no nappy bag, no stress, nothing. I'm actually surprised I'm late, but it was the traffic. One robot wasn't working and it took forever. I literally got home. I dropped all the stuff I was gonna do. They go into the swimming pool. Dizzy and the kids left me because I said to them, I'm gonna drive there. I mean, it would be so stupid. It's barely 800 meters from the house. So, we're gonna chill at the Left Star Center. Have fun in the pool. I'm bringing a lot of Mr. Peanuts food. I'm having a puffing because I'm pregnant and tired. Whew. So we're back home. We actually didn't even stay all that long at the pool. Peanut got into the water, and when it was time to get him out, there was this little breeze and it was getting him cold. And I was like, time out, I'm leaving. And when I said I'm leaving, then everybody else was like, I'm leaving. Except we had to convince Kayla Zabani because she was like, I'm not going anywhere. But we're back home. This is giving them a bath and I figured I might as well quickly show you guys what it is that we got from the baby expo. So I'm going to show you guys what we got first as like part of our goodie bag. They always put together such awesome goodie bags you guys. It's amazing. There was this brand that was exhibiting and presenting to us. I've always heard about it but I never really knew what it is they do until like today when the guy came in to give us a bit more information. They've given us this awesome goodie bag. Tons and tons of products in there. I'm not going to open it one by one because I don't have enough memory in my SD card right now now spf 50 which is awesome I, sh I wish i opened this before because i would have put this on peanuts he did have sunscreen though it just wasn't by this brand so there's gonna be a lot of um trying out to do here this is stretch marks prevention cream a bit too late for that but okay they give us this awesome giant goodie bag first thing when i opened it not even kidding look who i saw i was like oh look at that there was this little dumpling so stinking cute oh he was so adorable such a baby inside 
we have got the Himalava travel pack I haven't heard of this brand before I haven't used it so that super exciting time baby dove gift set cleansing cloth what's a cleansing cloth so let's see this removes makeup and paint assists with acne okay i'm really excited to try this it's called a wow jude cleansing cloth they have a whole lot of pamphlets which i'm not going to show you guys i'll just read up on that later antibacterial wet tissues i don't know if that means baby wipes but this is by the brand pigeon oh breast milk storage bags i'm definitely going to keep this because i'll be pumping in a few short months hi baby wet wipes I think this is a new brand it just came into the market because i saw they sell nappies and pa uh, baby pants like pull-ups and wipes so they gave a couple of nappies in there plus the baby wipes i'm really stoked to try that because i was a bit skeptical it is super affordable like the prices are not crazy but even then i was like i don't really want to risk it because i know peanuts are super sensitive and even though we are like full-on cloth diapering he does take disposables to school i wanted to try them for that but still yeah zimplex junior baby bum spray the jingle juice i don't know what's a jingle juice vitamins and minerals post postnatal and breastfeeding multivitamin and mineral daily supplement i really try to avoid taking these things when i'm breastfeeding okay especially since when i was in hospital with peanut they gave me this painkiller which was super amazing but he had the worst reaction to it and we didn't pick it up until afterward so i was straight on that painkiller for like two days straight and then i said on third day like just slow it down i don't feel that much pain and just give me the regular painkillers and that's when i was like oh my gosh that was giving him the reaction so i try by all means to not be on any kind of medication while i'm breastfeeding if baby's getting food from me still stay away even right now when i'm pregnant all i take is prenatal vitamins even when i have a headache i like thug it out <laughs> that's all we got this pampas aqua pure we've actually been trying these and we kind of sort of like them to be honest they are like regular pampas they do say that it's with organic cotton i haven't seen any difference at all except they're a bit pricey that's all vix baby rub comfort for babies we've been using and loving this pregnant pill is for pregnant and breastfeeding mothers purity nipple cream i don't know if this is teething or what is it for doesn't quite say yet ah cough bee syrup this i'm definitely gonna give to peanut right now i've really started to love zimplex all of a sudden i don't know why um we've been giving him the multivitamin and it works like magic since his pediatrician recommended it and this it's oh except it says children two to three years it starts at two to three years so i'd have to pump the brakes on that it's a damn shame i'm not sure what strips these are for but we have fat silicone dummy clip i'm not big on using dummies on my kids in fact all my kids have never liked dummies either but you never know surprise might just be a surprise and actually you like that it's in plex junior glycerin bar not sure what's in here but they also came to our meetup to come show us and tell us a bit more about their breast pump. It's basically just pamphlets and information. Sleep strap. Interesting. How many times have you seen your kid fall asleep on the car seat and their head looks like it's just about to fall out? Sleep strap might just be the solution. I've never heard of this brand or this product before, but definitely we'll be trying it out, especially since Peanut is going to be face front facing. And the last thing that we have in here is toothpaste interesting and this one is bamboo no yeah bamboo toothpaste eco awesome toothpaste with bamboo and green tea extract wow okay oh and then there is grown baby i almost forgot this because it's sitting on my lap ah you put this it's a pencil holder that's cute and then it's got teethers it holds your phone too anywho that's basically all we got in the goodie bag i'm gonna quickly show you guys what it is that i bought and then basically call it a day another super awesome product that we got is this 360 cap for munchkin and um, this you can use it as your toddler cap or your adult cap honestly i'm really considering keeping it for myself but kb has already asked for it so i guess we'll be sharing it because it's so cool you get to put fruits in the bottom if you're one of those people who like to like have fruit infused water 
I honestly think it's just waste of fruit. I would rather eat the fruit and then drink water. Um, but it's so cool. Even if Peanut tries to cry for what I'm drinking, I can still let him drink from it. Like we've been drinking this water together. It was just fine. No mess, none whatsoever. I went ahead and I bought a giant pack of Pampers Premium Care. And then I bought a giant box of Pampers Wipes as well. We always use Pampers Wipes. I got the sensitive ones. I'm not too sure why because we've been trying to use the sensitive ones but it's fine wipes is wipes the wipes mostly go to school we don't go through all that many wipes in the house but at school they do for sure these and i also got him a car seat which is currently in the car right now obviously because it's a car seat i tried to install it but i just couldn't for the life of me i couldn't get the isofix thing to pop out so i can just clip it to the isofix in the car so i was just like you know this will have to be Dizzy's problem. So he said actually it worked perfectly because he has to remove the car seats anyway so he can wash the car. So it's fine. When he's done washing, he's gonna do that. And uh, that's basically it. I'm super stoked to have Peanut front facing. I'm not too sure how that's gonna work out. He's been rear facing this whole time, but every time he's in his car seat, he would like fight so hard to push himself forward so he can turn his whole body and see what's going on. And the front seat and i was like this is just not working out apart from the fact that he's already outgrown his baby car seat and also we have to save it for baby surprise it was just time to get him a car seat so it's gonna be super fun i don't know how he's gonna react he's probably gonna be so stoked i can't wait anyway i hope you guys enjoyed watching this vlog i cannot believe for the life of me i have a graduate i have a graduate cave is gonna be in grade one in a little over six weeks what the heck like where did the time go this is crazy anyway i need to tidy up all of that mess that i just made on the dinner table i hope you enjoyed watching thumbs up if you watched this far and don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you besties in our next video bye besties